regard to the ocean, as well as in regards to the world's major issues, the climate and biodiversity, we must reaffirm the importance of a shared vision based on collective values and geared towards the common good for current generations as well as future generations. But something is different today. The climate crisis is growing. And most people in the world do not have a sense of connecting the dots between the two. You cannot solve the climate crisis without addressing the problems of the ocean, and you cannot solve the problems of the ocean without solving the crisis of climate. Human health goes hand in hand with the health of our planet. And a healthy planet cannot exist without a healthy ocean. We need to continue developing. We have a nation to build. How to reconcile conservation of our marine environment whilst allowing this economic development to take place? The answer we found is a simple one. It is the Blue Economy Development Model. We're talking about ambitious targets here, like uh, conservation of 30% uh, of the ocean until 2030. 100% should be protected, and in case you want to use the ocean, uh, maybe you should have to prove that what you're doing is safe. Regional hubs with vessels for ocean research, especially high seas research, deep ocean research, and open ocean research, will be transformative for small island developing states. We have the opportunity to take the lessons learned from the investments that have been made into climate finance, from work that has been done in other sectors. What is innovative is taking them and applying them into the ocean space. So we need you, the grassroots organizations who know the science on the ground, who know the communities on the ground, who are dependent on these marine ecosystems to help make sure that you're reinforcing the intelligence that we need to then make the right kinds of investments. Transformer les preuves scientifiques en bonne gouvernance est une question vraiment complexe et souvent très mal gérée. Les scientifiques et les politiciens ne suffiront pas à la tâche. Elle a besoin de la participation de citoyens bien informés, des entrepreneurs de l'industrie. The role of corporation and investors and bankers in resource management and the achievement of sustainable development objective is decisive. The corporation have significant assets for this and will trigger the needed level of impact. They are highly responsive. They can have a vital influence on their community of suppliers, users and customers. We are therefore pleased to see that the Monaco Blue Initiative has become a hotspot for strategic conversation about ocean issues, spurring connections, collaborations and side events leading up to Lisbon, among others, in the coming month. This is exactly the goal of the MBI and we are thrilled to provide a platform that helps those discussions move forward.